that's the first one. Woo! Thank you. So on the thing of like ancestry and stuff, prayer chain. Prayer chain. Most of these poems I haven't read before, so bear with me as well with that. Lord, I need a spiritual intervention. The type of intervening given in answer to prayers Feliciana must have prayed when she prayed for her descendants to be free from their master's clutches. I need an intervention like the ones that Lewis prayed when he was shipped from Trinidad to the Carolinas. All things around him tumultuously changed and he called out for his spirit to be calm. I need that kind of intervention. I require a spiritual intervention and divine intervention that like the kind asked for in the prayers Chester must have prayed when forced to decide between the North and the South, freedom or serving his proclaimed owner. I call for your intervening hand. I need an intervention like the kind Florence requested as she entered a brave new world where her children were legally free, but they were still seen as items, seen as property, honestly. I need a spiritual intervention of the likes Annie sought when her, when the North had a renaissance that the South could only dream of, that she could only dream of. And my, oh my, I need that kind of spiritual awakening and intervening that led to the dreams Arthur dreamt in hopes of better opportunities for his children, their children, and their children. I need the kind of spiritual intervention my dad marched for in Washington seeking equal jobs and fair treatment as a human being. Today, I need to be the recipient of their spiritual pleas for the most high's mighty intervention. Thank God, I need a spiritual intervention my mother experienced when believing that her children should be given grades they earned, not the less than an option imposed on her because of her skin. I need the spiritual intervention that her mother Odessa prayed for when the family fracturing migration north was deemed necessary. I also need the spiritual, the spiritual fortitude that Laura experienced when having multiple children and limited means while never receiving her promised restitution. And I need the intervention Sarah and her minister husband received in response to their intercessory prayers pray as the world changed and vacancy rules became a color's only penalty. I desperately need the spiritual support and endurance lettuce instilled in us after seeking it every day while enslaved and Lord, I need a spiritual intervention that Lucinda must have prayed for and exhibited as she posed for her master's photo. I need this spiritual intervention, the kind in which my foremothers and forefathers prayed for and for me long before there was a me and today empowers me to live and operate in excellence despite the insidious descendants of racism and slavery that has always plagued my kin. It's the enemy that bred me, raised me, and chased me, but won't break me as I resolutely match its determined flares today. 